Hey y'all, Appleback, and of course with Pepper. Uh, it's my birthday. Um, I turned the big 4-0 today, and uh, just wanted to, I haven't done a video in a while. Um, I'll get to that. Uh, I'll, this will be kind of like a little update vlog. Uh, I just wanted to make a real quick video. Um, just letting y'all know what's going on, and that I'm still alive, and some more plans in the future, things like that. Um, and of course, I gotta, I gotta show off Pepper here. Um, but yeah, it's my birthday. Um, I turned a big 4-0 today. Um, exciting, I suppose. Uh, <laughs> um, officially, uh, hit that, I guess what everyone would call the, uh, midlife, uh, year and, uh, being in the military, I feel old. Um, I am older than almost everyone in my shop. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, um, good stuff but uh i wanted to show off uh like my my wife is amazing my mom is amazing and uh they uh they spoil me and i just wanted to show some stuff off and then talk a little bit about uh what i what what i've been noticing about my channel like good things and uh yeah um well, let's get to it so first thing um is these glasses so uh, uh my wife loves getting glasses from um this website called zenny uh, which I, I love. Um, I am a big, big hater on the big name brand, uh, eyeglass stuff. Cause, um, there was a really good Adam ruins everything video where he talked about how literally all of the brands, like even the cheap brands are all owned by the same conglomerate that makes all the same damn glasses and this monopoly that they have and they even have it over the freaking um optometrists that do the testing and does all that um that you know it allows them to just control the market and make people spend hundreds of dollars on these damn eyeglasses and uh you can still get really really nice looking eyeglasses for uh not a whole lot and um i noticed that these don't have that much glare to them. It's kind of nice. Um, it's a little bit when I do that, but yeah, uh, ultimately it's really nice. Um, I've been trying to do some of my videos when I'm not actually looking at the screen, like playing a video game without that. Cause I'm not a fan of the glare. Um, but I wanted to show these off to y'all and, uh, thanks to my wife for that. Uh, she also, um, this is probably the most amazing thing. This is the thing I was just my wife is amazing. So she's been, um, uh, she took up crocheting, um, and she's always known how to crochet, but she got really into it, uh, when we moved, uh, moved her to Tennessee and, uh, she's been making some really, really cool stuff. And, uh, she made this in secret, didn't, didn't tell me about it. She was always saying she was working on a project for somebody else or whatever. And, uh, she gave it to me and I absolutely love it. So, um, I'll try and see if I can do this without like yanking my microphone off the, uh, um, table here, but she made me this blanket. It's beautiful. Um, I love the colors. Like it's just, she has amazing taste. The, the edging on it is so cool. The stitch that she does is so freaking cool. Uh, it's so clean looking. Um, I haven't really used it cause it's like, um, I love it so much and pretty much all the places I would use it would be the same place. This little, this little thing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm talking about you pepper. Um, she would go, uh, she's not very destructive anymore, but, um, when she wants to get comfortable, uh, she likes to dig and I really, really, really don't want her to dig up my blanket. Yeah. I'm talking about you. Yeah. Um, so yep, had that. And then, uh, I'm going to have to take my earbuds out for this part, but she got me this awesome, awesome shirt and um, I'm wearing it right now. So you can see the pocket there. It's got a Snoopy on there, just lounging on a beach ball. Love it. It is the most like breathable, nice, soft, thin fabric. It's perfect for like how stupid hot it is right now in Las Vegas. And, um, uh, let me show you the back and then I'll show you the shorts that she also got me. So one second. So, yeah, 
Um, pretty freaking cool. Uh, absolutely love it. Um, yeah, right? Yeah. Um, and then uh, just some other like little tiny things that she uh, she got me. She's noticed. She likes how I've been really, and I don't know why my color keeps flashing back and forth. Um, I think I have some auto color balance thing going on and it is freaking out. So my bad. Um, but she, uh, also knows that I'm been really into keeping my, um, my dad's truck nice and clean. Um, I'm still definitely a work in progress. Um, and, uh, but like I've gotten really into detailing it. I might show a video of some of my things I'm doing for that. Um, but, uh, she got me this cool stuff and it's called gunk gear. Um, best way I can describe this for any of y'all old enough to remember this, you know, those little coin operated, like, uh, um, toy things that you can like get, you know, toys or candy or whatever out of, um, they always came in that stupid plastic thing that, you know, pops off and there'd be like this little sticky hand on a long sticky string thing. Um, this stuff kind of reminds me of that. Um, basically, uh, it's this flubber that you like push down into the cracks and crevices. Um, it like talks about using it in your car. You can use it on your keyboard, uh, whatever. And then you pull it off. And then of course it brings all the dirt and nasty stuff with it as well. Um, and it's such a great idea. Cause I always remembered my mom or dad would like get me one of those, those silly, like quarter, quarter operated, um, sticky hand things. And the second it touched anything, all the dirt that was on that would be on the little sticky hand thing or whatever, the little flubber or Play-Doh or whatever it is. And it ain't getting out. Like it's, you have to throw that stuff away because it's just covered in like, you know, hair and um, dirt and rocks and whatever else it happened to touch. So a uh, great idea for um, uh, what I would uh, hope is a fairly inexpensive product. Obviously, I'm not the kind of person who's going to ask how much a gift costs or anything like that. I just appreciate it. Uh, she's incredibly thoughtful. She's always thinking about all the little things that I'm doing, all the little things. And um, she's just amazing at just picking out things that are <laughs> uh, amazing. So uh, thank you so much to my wife for that. Um, and uh, yeah. Um, and the biggest present of all is she's flying in tonight. So, uh, I'm uh, super excited. She actually just got on her plane and, uh, it should be, let me pull up my, uh, tracker I got on her. I love that. I've been getting really into the flight sim stuff, which I'm going to talk about. Um, cause, uh, yeah, uh, it looks like they're probably sitting on the, uh, taxiway right now, getting ready to take off. Cause, uh, it looks like should be taken off here in about 10 minutes or so and we'll be landing in approximately four hours from now. So, uh, real, real excited about that. Cannot wait to pick her up. So with that, um, I probably not just probably, I won't be putting up any videos for probably good 10 plus days. Um, I, I've, uh, something that I've been working on and, um, the last few trips I took out to Tennessee and it's been amazing. I've been like detaching myself from certain technologies, um, that I appreciate and that I find, you know, the absolute use out of and everything. But when I'm with my wife and this is like precious time, I am, you know, living separate from her. So we don't get to spend time together as often as we obviously would like. Um, I mean, shit, when we were living together, I hated being at work cause I just wanted to be home with her. Um, and so being on the opposite side of the country from each other, um, uh, definitely like even more so I just, I so badly want to just spend quality, good time with her. So, um, with that, I am, um, not going to, um, stream, make videos. I'm going to spend as little time on my phone as humanly possible. Um, because, uh, you know, that time I have with her is going to be the most important thing for me. So, uh, just keep that in mind. Um, not that it really matters too much, but let me get to my channel. Um, 
So, um, and I just realized I forgot to thank my mom. Uh, she sent me a gift card to Amazon, uh, which I really appreciate. I'm going to, uh, um, I have some ideas that I'm going to probably use on that. So uh, with my channel, with, you know, streaming, uh, what's been crazy is that uh, you guys have been, I've been getting a lot more viewers um, unexpectedly. Um, I would, did a little test video where I spent about an hour uh, recording myself making a uh, Microsoft Flight Sim video um, just to see if uh, all my audio and video and, you know, the game looked fine on my capture and uploaded it and I didn't think much of it and then all of a sudden it got over 200 views which is like kind of insane for me uh, most of my videos are like one two maybe ten ten views and all of my videos are starting to do better um, so I guess people are finding my videos and they're watching them I'm grateful um, so with that I will say if you enjoy my content if you enjoy watching me um, and you want to help me out you do not need to give me any money, nothing like that. Um, but uh, what really helps with the whole YouTube thing, uh, subscribe, um, either hit the thumbs up or thumbs down button on there and um, put a comment on. Uh, apparently these are all things that encourage the uh, um, YouTube algorithm to send people my way um, to basically say, hey, this video might be worth putting on the front page people might actually watch it and continue to watch it so um yeah so there's that and uh for future stuff i am i've gotten really really into the flight sim stuff um they recently announced the flight sim 2024 coming out later this year that looks amazing so i am planning on playing that and uh up until then, I plan on doing, I want to do a lot of content for that. So I'm going to be bouncing back and forth between making um, flights and videos. And I'm going to be um, continuing to make the videos where I just talk about nerdy stuff. Those are like my two favorite things right now. They just fuel me. I love it. it um, I love doing anything where it like pushes my knowledge and it pushes my skills and it makes me learn new things. And I have never had more fun learning how to do something than like flying even if it is just in a simulator um so uh and i i actually still have all of my ground school books from when the air force sent me to a little like week-long uh course out in texas and what i was thinking of doing and i thought this would be really fun educational informative um and maybe entertaining is i'm gonna kind of go through each little aspect in the book and try and recreate the practice that you would do to practice whatever that part in the ground school uh, written exam test book type stuff um, how that applies to flying in the flight simulator um, almost as if i were being my own flight instructor and i'm using microsoft flight sim to do so um, and if it takes off and it keeps going i mean i'm going to be down to absolutely slowly upgrade my you know um my flight sim environment because right now i just have rudder pedals i have a stick with like a built-in little throttle on the back side um, i do have a throttle uh that came with the kit and i'll do a video where i show this stuff off at some point um but i didn't really like it it was designed to be just for airliners and maybe if i get into the whole airliner thing maybe i'll uh consider hooking that thing up but when it came to flying my little cessna it just did not did not do the trick for me so yeah um uh and speaking of i think i already know some of the few little things i'm planning on using my uh gift card from amazon with my uh that my mother um graciously uh gave me uh i'm gonna try and organize my desk a little bit better so i'm gonna um, look at getting me some monitor arms uh to free up some space on my desk and um I think I'm going to do a slight little upgrade to my computer. I'm just going to, it's got 16 gigs of Ram. I noticed flight sim, uh, can chunk that away very quickly. And, um, uh, especially when you're streaming it or recording it at the same time. So I'm going to, um, just buy another, the exact same kit that I already have to take it from 16 up to 32. Um, 
And uh, yeah, uh, other than that, I'll just hold on to the remainder. I always find stuff that I don't really need on Amazon and I'll just get it or I'll use it to buy gifts for my wife because I like to do that as well. Um, yeah, so uh, exciting stuff. I'm really happy to, to like this has been a great birthday. Um, I'm excited to, to um, see my wife and uh, um, and I'm excited to make some videos for y'all at some point. Um, we'll see where this channel takes me um i didn't really expect some of these videos to do as well as they did this quickly and uh even my wife was like you need to keep making videos like she she likes to watch uh, certain youtubers and um you know when she started to see that my view count like kind of skyrocketed on that one video she's like you should keep making videos like just keep doing it and let's see where this goes because you know um if we can if we can get Google to to pay me to do stuff that I just enjoy doing and that people find entertaining, great. I I'm excited for that. So yeah. Um other than that, y'all, uh I don't really have too much else to fill y'all in on. Um again, uh probably about ten plus days before I put up any more content after this. Um but uh yeah. Um let me see if I can get Pepper on the camera real quick before I go. Pepper, come here. Come on. No? Yeah. Come here. Yo. Okay. Oh, I need you to. I need you to sit and. Okay. Yes. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Look at that camera. Okay. All right. Say bye. Say bye. Say bye. 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 Okay. <laughs> she's annoyed with me now anyway y'all um again if you really really enjoy my content or you think i'm a good person or whatever and you want to support me um please do consider subscribing if you haven't already um thumbs up thumbs down is cool uh comments throw comments on there if you have suggestions i am very very open to any kind of criticism um i know i should probably edit my videos more cut some of those you know awkward silence like that out whatever um i just i hate editing so um maybe one day i'll get the motivation to edit my videos a little bit more but um yeah um or just comments like questions if you have any questions for me um there's pretty much nothing i won't answer um and uh yeah so anyway i'll i'll see you on the next one bye